Anyways, shovel head eight turned little Timmy. And welcome to another Fast Iron Wednesday, and this is the challenge for the month of, month of March 2023, which is chicken fried anything. So, my first stab at it is going to be chicken fried steak, but I couldn't get the steak I wanted, so I got a roast, which I'm going to trim up, slice up, and pound out. And then bread it like chicken. We even have cheater stuff. I know it's supposed to be just flour, but we'll get there later. So, anyways, uh, yeah, we can cut this apart. I hurt myself pretty bad with this knife once, but that's a long story. Okay. I imagine if we cut this in four, it's going to be pretty thick. So we're going to try cutting it in five. One, two. One. two. Three. Four. By the way, if anybody's asking, this is a inside round. We're pounding this out, so I'd rather have it cut straight, but uh, I'm willing to take whatever I get today. And so is my little helper here, who just appeared, Mr. Harper. So anyways, I'm going to trim this stuff up and uh, pound it out. And we'll come back after that because it's really okay. boring. Okay, there's our uh, pounded out steak. Well, it was roast, now it's the steak. Except I see one piece of trimmed and there's our trims which are going into a frying pan for doggy treats so we're going to come back we're going to get our breading station set up bread these and put them out on a rack to uh, mature a bit you know it's almost three o'clock so we'll be back anyways there's our uh, our breaded steak so we're going to leave them hang out on the rack in the fridge for a while and let the coating set up and then it doesn't want to fall off as easy. We'll see if that works but uh, anyways uh, we'll come back much later. Okay, our Brussels sprouts are cooked, they're pretty easy to cook. We're going to start to start on our steaks now. So. We'll put the ugly one in first. And maybe we've got enough room for two. That will save me a lot of time. Okay, well, that's not going to be that exciting, so we'll shut her off. Anyways, here's our plating done. We have our chicken fried steak, or at least what I would call chicken fried steak. 
because I've never eaten it anywhere except what I've made. Some fried uh, Brussels sprouts, some boiled potatoes with uh, cream gravy, and then a, a biscuit with butter. And that's about it. It's time for our DIY dark matter taste test. But first, I almost forgot my taste testers. This isn't going to take them long. Okay, we've got a couple things to do, so hold on. Anyways, I almost forgot. Timmy had to pick out his teeth. You be quiet. It's not your turn to talk yet. Anyways. It's for, uh, Adventure Type. That's what it was. It was actually on clearance at John Tiger for three bucks. So, anyways, I have my two taste testers here and they're plates full, so I better get at it. Jonah. Her. They've already had all like the trimmings cooked up and uh, with their supper. So don't think they're get they're getting so short changed. I guess that's it. Clean plate club. Anyways, we're back. I think. Supper's a little cold, but anyways, there's a fly by, drive by, and we'll give it a try. You want a piece? See if it meets the, meets the standard. I guess so. Potatoes and cream gravy. Bite a biscuit. You have dessert coming too. And a piece of steak. If they're brought around, it's not bad. Anyways, cast iron lenses, he was started by Native Tears, and she keeps a playlist on her channel. The link down below. You can check out Steve at uh, Dutchie's Cooking. His link will be down below. Uh, check out the playlist. Cook something up. Uh, we'd be glad to uh, add it to the playlist. It doesn't have to be a challenge. Like we have a monthly challenge, but it doesn't have to be. So, uh, whatever. Uh, we're always happy to see new faces. Oh, yeah. That's from Ordinary Joe MRE. And, uh, He's branching off into the fire thing that fired up Friday on Fridays, so I'll leave his link down below as well. So thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you next week. Well, oh, time for dessert. Anyways, it's... Uh not much. It's uh, biscuit rolled out, rolled with brown sugar and, and butter, and regular canned cherry by color. Mom used to make us this cherry pins. That well, was good enough for me then, and it's good enough for me now. Anyways, thank you for coming and sharing. We'll see you next week.